No, we're trying to get a thumbnail, everyone. Alrighty. What's up everyone, Bo here from BZ Hub, and I have something crazy to show you because last Wednesday we had one heck of a stream. I have to say, I can only think of one other stream that was crazier than this one, and that was the time we got five Gemsbok, and uh, three of them were diamond, and two of them I messed up, and they weren't diamonds, uh, but we could have came out of it with five diamond Gemsbok. I can't remember now if we got three or four. That's the only crazier stream I can think of because with this new True Red up Update, we spent the entire stream off in Quattro Colinas, and not only did we find a diamond true red deer there, but we also found a diamond mouflon and then a second true red deer just to throw it a little sprinkle on top there. A little, 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 little sprinkle on top. But anyway, let me show you what I'm talking about. Let's start out with the mouflon and then we'll end with the two true red deer and see what you think about that. I'm eager to hear in the comments what you think about the new true red deer and then uh, I might do a little comparison at the end. Compare the two antlers, the legacy true red or the legacy red deer versus the new true red deer and uh, we'll do a little talk about that as well. But let's get into it. I have to shut you down. We, uh, we found a level five mouflon now could be I know we're hunting red deer okay I know we're hunting red deer but this could be our first diamond <laughs> you mute me? if you want to or you can just chat along I don't care be a part of the stream he's nervous right now I feel like he's gonna leave it's gonna be like that gems block that we found on Verhanga a while back where we had a super easy shot on him and we didn't take it thinking that he would just be like right back pretty quickly and he never did there he is no I don't see him where'd he go where'd you go you mouflon Dropped him dead. Dropped him dead. Dusty got uh, trolled by earlier by Mouflon. Oh no. Oh no. Oh yeah. Megan says she's been binge watching the Fishing Planet videos. She says she's trying to catch up. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> That's awesome. I love to hear about a playlist I have being binge watched. That's awesome. <laughs> okay. Here is our potential diamond Mouflon. This isn't going to make for a great photo, but you know what? This is all I can do. I have no idea. They're terrible photos. All right. Diamond. Diamond. Who says diamond? Zachy says gold. <laughs> Probably will be. I, it wouldn't surprise me. You know, let's go. Let's let's see. Let's see. Shall we? It's a diamond. 182.6. Look at that. Look at this dude. Oh, my God. He was born with his horn as part of his body. <gasps> So sad. He's like those uh those pigs. Those are they Asiatic pigs? The ones with the horns that grow into their skull. Oh my golly. Very cool. Well, we're supposed to be searching for red deer, but we find a diamond move on, you know? Zaki <laughs> Celebration. Celebration. 100 bits. <laughs> right on. Right What's on. What's you up to, Brenton? How many diamonds is that now? I have no idea. 34, maybe? Not a lot. But, you know, we're just... We're just messing around. What are the freaking chances? And there's a level 6 over there as well. I honestly have no idea what to expect here. Okay. So we're getting our, um... Getting our first chance at a level nine red deer now. I think uh, I think we should be able to pull off a pretty easy lung shot from here. I think uh, I think a lung shot's the best we're going to be able to do. How far away are we now? I think we can pretty much just aim straight at him. He's at 250. Yeah. Yeah. 
we're not going to be able to, if we go any further closer to him, we're just going to end up going away. He's at 50 to 75 now. We'll put a second bullet in him too if he uh, if he decides to stop. But I think he's going to fall. There he goes. Down the mountainside he goes. Are these any good roe deer here? Drop that guy too for a comparison shot. Demon Scythe, you did miss something good. I'm sorry. But uh, you know what? We still got him. We still got him over here for you to take a look at. Okay, so we shot two red deer here. Here they are. Here's red deer number one, and here is red deer number two. And you know, it's a little disappointing seeing the level nine here um, versus the seven that we shot a little bit ago. Um, but yeah, what can you say? Let's, um, I'm not sure. I'm hoping that we can pick up this guy first. Let's try it. If not, then we'll just see if we got a diamond, I guess. <laughs> okay, so we did pick up the, yeah, we picked up the smaller one. That's good. So this was the, the level six, just for a comparison there. Pretty massive on the antlers, the main beams. There's a level six, and now we are left with the level nine here. He didn't fall very gracefully. Okay, here we go, resting his little noggin on the... Uh, on the rock there. Let's see which way should we face? This way, this way, this way. Pew! He is a diamond. 253.9. .9. Two points above diamond there. And look at that rack. My goodness gracious. That is a diamond red deer right there. A diamond true rack red deer at that. We can go to the true score. We're not going to get a very good look at him. But, um... But that... Is alright. We're going to have to go to the lodge after this and put him in the, um... Put him in the lodge so we can see what he looks like. Let's taxidermize him right now. First diamond true rack red deer there. Look at him. Look at him. He's a monster. He is a monster. I wish he did look a little cooler, I guess. I don't know if coolers, obviously that's not a word at all, but I wish he did look cool. Like uh, Buckmaster has subscribed. Hey, thank you so much, Buckmaster. I really appreciate that. Hope to see more of you, that's for sure. Um, but you know what? The level sevens look amazing. The le and I love the variation of the level sevens. And during the beta, if you were there for that stream, I remember shooting level eight and thinking, you know, these antlers look weird. And the level sevens look so cool. So why do the level eights look so weird? And now we have a level nine. And he's very symmetric. Um, and he's definitely got a ton of mass. Uh, I just, I, you know, I, I'm just being picky, I guess. Maybe I'm just being picky. I just need to be happy about it. Really cool. We came out here for one thing, and by golly, we found it on the first map on the second lake. So, uh, that is awesome. I love how he's in, like, mid-chew right now. I'm actually going to record this, too, just so I can put them both put them both in the video you know so this yeah like I said this is the level 8 we'll see what the difference between the level 8 and the level 9 is basically look at that it's like a big medieval mace there so there is a giant difference in points like the point value um, 22 versus 26 points um, lower beams are I'm trying to remember some of these values but yeah 217 versus 253 that's a big jump between eight and nine, but uh, I mean, there's a lot of stuff to measure on these antlers as well, so understandable, understandable, but also these antlers are quite a bit smaller, I feel, than the other ones. Still cool antlers, though. He shot the one, though. There he is. He's right there. Dude. Hey, you need to reload. Yeah. <laughs> Gosh dang it. And of course, you know, I'm freaking standing there going, well, I don't think we're going to find anything else. I think this is the whole horde. The whole horde here, guys. Hacks confirmed. <laughs> He'll come back. He's in a zone. He is in the zone. 
He's in the zone. Let's try to get up a little bit closer. They're all nervous right now because of the gunshot, but I think, I think it'll be fine. We've already got one of them, and I didn't really take the time to get closer to him because he was up on a mountaintop. But uh, now we have a chance for a second one, so I might as well try to get closer. No, we're trying to get a thumbnail, everyone. Don't you know? Once it's in the game, once it, you know, once it's gone, it's gone. Alrighty. Looks like he dropped right there. Get wrecked, dear. Hey. Get it with the bow. <laughs> Look at this dude. What are we thinking? I don't know. The antlers don't seem as long. Am I crazy for thinking that? Am I crazy for thinking the antlers don't seem as long? I don't know. They do seem pretty long now. And I well, at least we can get a better picture from this dude. Lego, what are we thinking? Blue Fox says 253-ish. 253.5-ish. Just have fun says it's a diamond. It's a diamond. All right, here we go. Here we go. What do we think? Oh, hello. It is a diamond. 253.7. 253.7. 51 is what you need to be a diamond. So yeah, we, we lucked out, Zach. But uh, yeah, this dude is, is pretty freaking sweet. Second diamond red deer of the night. Got the diamond move on. Had the two diamond red deer. Look at the true score here. Wowie zowie. Wowie zowie. Still had 26 tines there. Same as the last one. Tan Tan says, kind of ugly. Well, this is pretty much exactly what the last one looked like. <laughs> Very cool. Very cool anyway. Oh, Zachary. This has been a crazy stream, dude. All right, we're in the lodge now. Thought we'd show off a little comparison. You can see that this is kind of my uh, Hirschfelden Quattro Colinas lodge here. Um, I thought it was pretty good. Uh, two maps to com combine together, being European and whatnot. So here we have a uh, legacy red deer here. It's a level nine, but as you'll see, it's only 946. Didn't quite make the 950 mark but fortunately for us I do have this guy right here a 989 legacy red deer here and uh, he's pretty magnificent it doesn't uh, doesn't get much better than that um, only 11 points off from a thousand red deer there and then of course we have the true red deer here that we just got in the stream and I can go ahead and just uh, switch out Let's, uh, let's go ahead and do that. Let's switch out this guy here so that we can uh, put the other true red deer that we shot. I don't know. Good pose for him. Let's do that one. Okay. So now we have our two true red deer here. You can see even the, the change in the faces here. This one's got more of a tan face and this one's got more of a white face. That's kind of a fun little detail there. But we can take a look at the difference of the rack here. There's the rack of this guy, and uh, remember that it's 253.7 versus 253.9, I want to say. So there is the difference there. Pretty cool looking deer. Can't complain about it. You know, you really can't complain. But uh, good looking deer there, but then you have the legacy. Legacy red deer there. So, legacy versus the true rack legacy true rack and you know i did talk with uh tk everyone knows our good friend tree kiwi old matt um talking with him a, a little bit about the the racks because i guess people have been concerned saying that these aren't very realistic these true rack red deer antlers and so he posted some uh, antlers of you know obviously some trophy red deer and they're quite a bit bigger than these um diamond red deer that we have in the game right now so i was asking him you know are there larger racks out there for diamond red deer um you know kind of thinking about like cape buffalo how there are you know smaller horns and then there are larger horned cape buffalo and he said that the diamond red deer have multiple racks um you know as far as how they look so i'm really hoping and it doesn't help that i shot two of them that almost look exactly the same um but i am really hoping 
that we can find a, uh, a diamond red deer that looks kind of like some of the level sevens we've been shooting because those look amazing and uh and i and i can't wait to try and find something else but i am eager to see your diamond red deer down in the discord check out the bz hub discord make sure you're showing off your diamonds in the uh, trophy flexing page there love to see love to see everyone's trophies here from the hunter call of the wild while you're out there in the description check out the Twitch channel. Check us both out, both me, BZ Hub, and my brother Zacchaeus on Twitch. Follow us if you want to see more gameplay from both of us. And uh, yeah, like and subscribe if you haven't already. Really appreciate it. Liking the videos always help in uh, spreading them out to everyone. And I really appreciate everyone who likes the videos. It's fantastic. So can't wait for our next stream. Hopefully doing something this weekend. But if anything, we'll see you on Monday, everyone. Until then, take care, and as always, keep gaming, never stop.